life is both fragile and beautiful. The real beauty of a wedding for me has never been based on how many flowers there are or how expensive the dress is. Uh, it's always been based on three things, love, place and connection. Because it's these three things that I think make all weddings beautifully the same. Giving people reminders of the love that exists in their lives is my goal. Uh, and it's those reminders that I think grow in value over the years of your marriage. It's those reminders that may be used to help you through a tough time, to remind you of happier times. Um, it's those reminders that may be used to remember a loved one. Wedding days are inherently all about people. Uh, to me, it doesn't matter where your wedding takes place. It could be a local town hall that's just as interesting as a beautiful winery is. I'm a wedding photographer because I get to connect with people and tell stories about really wonderfully interesting humans. Your wedding is your wedding, full of love and the people who mean something to you. And I chase honesty at weddings. I do this to treat people and myself with love and kindness and to produce something that feels honest and real, focusing on the things that I think matter. People are also an interesting challenge for me. I find that meeting new people is something that I've really come to love doing process of figuring out what makes them the way they are, what they have passions about, what they love about life, what they want for their future. Because listening first and listening well is the foundation of everything that I do. Sure there's strength in a well composed, pleasing to the eye image, but without that human element, without a feeling that has been felt and imprinted into the image, then it is just that, an image. Images from a wedding day should become heirlooms and they should remind you of the love that exists in your life. I do this because I love people, I love making friends and I love forming relationships. I'm Alex and I'd love to spend some time with you.